Okay, so this is part two of the step down transformer. And we get this odd voltage when we would go phase the ground. And uh, I don't know if I get a good connection. There it is. Something like that. There you go. The voltage drop is really bad here because we're about a mile away from the service. But phase the ground on one and the other one. It's balanced out now. Remember before. There we go. I gotta get a good connection. It was uh, one leg had like 200 volts or some shit. I don't remember. Um, so. I think what happened is I converted all the lighting that this feeds um, to LED and I mean, this is a fair amount of lighting. You got all these column lights, you got lights up on trees, every single tree in this area. So it feeds a lot of stuff. But the amp draw is significantly lower because they're LED. Um, yeah. These are main. Yeah, seven. I mean, that's a lot lower than it was being, you know, metal halide magnetic. <laughs> um, but what I figured out is that it will create its own neutral but you have to bond it to ground and I was afraid to do that because nowhere did it say that in the instructions um, but x2 x3 that's your neutral why nobody told me that I don't know I had to call the, the place and be like hey why do I get a weird voltage? He explained to me, you have to have uh, one side of the secondary bonded to neutral if you're gonna use neutral loads. If you're not gonna use neutral loads, it doesn't really matter, but you still will get a funky voltage. Because all the lighting here is 240, so it doesn't matter. But um, I'm curious to see what happens if I hook this bitch up. And when when I measure this alleged neutral to ground, um, I don't get anything. So that leads me to believe that I can hook it up and then get my 120 loads. Then I can get rid of this 240 to 120 step down transformer because it's literally doing nothing if I can have 120 volt loads in here but I gotta try it out for a okay b-roll that's it that x2 x3 is your neutral leads on x1 x4 those are your phases and the x2 x3 is your neutral and there's living proof it's bonded to ground so shut the fuck up. This I'm going to take out now. And it's just a... Uh, it's the same type of transformer. It's a little bit smaller. 5 kVA. And it is... Going 240 to 120. But if I have a neutral over here, there's no point for that. I can just put some single pole breakers in here. And be done with it. So that's what I'm going to do. So, with that, uh, keep coming back.